snake oil underneath all of this, right? That was November 13th you were here, is that right? 14th? 14th? Yep. And today's March 1st, so we're gonna see how this stuff holds up. Yeah, so we got some nice stuff to clean up. So we'll give this thing the old touchless one too. All right, so since we have the, the trailer hooked up today, we're gonna use my zip lines and the mezzo foam cannons to apply the stars and stripes. We're gonna have a lot of fun power washing this. Man. First thing I gotta do, that corner's got a lot of grease on it and I don't wanna make a mess. I'm gonna use my wipes to get that real quick. Dude, this grease, man. We're gonna handle this before it gets all over my my nice walls. Oh my gosh! I'd rather have it on the wipe than on my floor, man. <laughs> or on my toolbox. Yeah, you know, I got my tools right here, you know. Go <laughs> find Conan. Hey, there you are. You wanna come wash your truck? Let's go. <laughs> oh, <laughs> she can do the, the pre-wash inspection, maybe. What do you think, Kona? Is it dirty enough or what? straight up this is enough to, to remove snake oil so let's see what this looks like we'll just do the right half of the hood here and if it changes if, it, if the right half looks different than the left half then the left half still has snake oil on it I mean that makes sense right <laughs> Snake oil, just the paint. Wow. And that was how many washes, you said? I don't know, between 25 and 30. How about that? <laughs> yeah, that's cool, man. What a great, what a great product that turned out to be, dude. Yeah, 
That stuff is like held on even better than I expected. Cool. That's a drying towel. We just got those in. See if it's any good, man. I'll grab this guy. It takes to keep your wash bay looking mint, man. <laughs>